Hello and welcome to the IT8500X3 remote control tutorial. The goal of this video is to teach you the ins and outs of the IT8500X3 remote to better understand how to use it and to get the most out of your massage chair. This video is going to be split up into three different parts, remote layout and functions, menu walkthrough, and pairing Bluetooth devices. To start, we're going to go over the button layout on the front face of the remote and what each of the buttons do. Afterward, we will go over the menu to start an auto program, then customize the massage using the different features of the chair. And lastly, we will show you how to pair your Bluetooth device to your IT8500X3. Let's begin by turning on the remote by pressing the red power button below the display screen. This button is used to turn the chair on and off when connected to the power and when the power switch on the back of the chair is turned to the on position. To the right of the power button, we have the up-down arrow buttons. The up-down arrows are used to fine-tune the shoulder height of the back mechanism right after the initial body scan. They are also used in the manual point or manual partial mode to position the back mechanisms to the location you desire. Below the power button, we have the menu button. Pressing this button will bring up the home screen where most of the chair's functions are located. We will return to this in part two of the video. Next is the auto program button. When pressed, this brings up a list of six auto programs that you can use with the start of a button. There is sports refresh, extension, rest and sleep, working relief, neck and shoulder, and waist and spine. In the center, you have the directional pad and the OK button. This will help you navigate through the menu and the OK button allows you to confirm a selection. While in a program, you can use the up and down directional buttons to adjust the mechanism speed and the left and right buttons to change the airbag intensity. At the bottom left of the directional pad, we have the heat button. This allows you to quickly turn the lumbar heat on or off. To the right of that, we have the airbag button. When pressed, this brings you to a menu where you can adjust the section and the intensity of the airbags. The next buttons are the 3D button along with the footrest and backrest adjustment buttons. While in auto program or manual mode, pushing the 3D button will change the intensity of the massage. Use a lower intensity for a light tissue massage or a higher intensity for a deep tissue massage. The intensity meter shows on the display. Around the 3D button, there are two sets of adjustment buttons for the footrest or backrest. When holding down the footrest adjustment buttons, this allows you to raise or lower the footrest. You can adjust the backrest just the same. This allows the chair's backrest to recline or bring the chair to an upright position. Now let's walk through the menu. Let's press the menu button. On the screen, you will see seven different menu options. Auto, Manual, 3D Massage, Sway, Airbag, Heat, and Settings. It is very easy to navigate through the different menu options. Just use the directional pad to navigate the menu and press OK to select an item. We're going to start with the top and work our way down the list. The first option is Auto. This brings up the Auto Program button that we saw when we pushed the Auto button earlier. Each of these auto programs provides a different massage that is designed to stimulate muscles and ease tension. I recommend trying each one out and seeing what feels best for you, or varying them based on how you feel that day. Going back to the main menu, navigate down and select Manual. This will bring up the manual menu displaying six different options you can adjust. Mode, Part, Width, Speed, Roller, and Zero. Let's select Mode. These are different techniques of massage that this chair offers. As you can see, there are five options, kneading, tapping, knocking, shiatsu, sink, and rhythm. Try each one of them and see which one you enjoy the most. Now with the type of massage selected, let's select Part. Here you have three options, Whole, Partial, and Point. If you select whole, this sets the rollers to utilize the entire S-track in the massage chair. This is from your neck to lumbar. For a more focused massage, select partial. This setting moves the rollers in a 6-8 to eight inch section where they currently are on the S-track. 
For a more targeted area, select the point option and going back to the display screen, use the up and down adjustment buttons to move the rollers to any desired position on your body along the S track. Returning back to the manual menu, there are four more settings to adjust. To change the width of the rollers, simply select width and you will see three options, a wide, medium, and narrow. If you want to change the speed of the rollers on the S-Track, you can adjust those settings in speed on the menu. Here we have six different options to choose from, one being slowest and six being fast. To change the speed of the foot rollers, select roller and choose from any of the available speed options, one, two, three, and off, one being slowest and three being fast. And last in the manual menu is zero gravity, Select zero and here you will see an option to simply turn on or off the zero gravity features. Now that we have learned the ins and outs of the manual menu, let's return to the main menu and continue going down the menu features that really set this chair apart. Once back at the main menu, navigate down and select 3D Massage. As a 3D massage chair, these special programs were built to highlight these features and to have full control over how deep the rollers massage you. In the 3D massage menu, you will see three options, mode, force, and part. In the mode functions, we have three programs to choose from that really show the most of the 3D features. There is a deep shiatsu, which is a 10 minute deep tissue back massage. Next is healthy breath, which is a five minute massage that features a rhythm for breathing in and out. And lastly, we have a massage, Extend, which is a five minute extension program. To change the intensity of the 3D massage, you can adjust the force in the force option within the menu. Here you can choose between any of the different options, one through five, one being light tissue and five being more deep tissue. Adjust these until you find a setting that is most suitable for you. Just like in the manual settings, you can adjust the area that is being massaged using the part option within the menu. Select part. Then just like in the manual mode, you can choose between a whole body massage, a partial massage that will massage you in a six to eight inch area where the rollers are currently are, or you can select point where you can adjust the massage to any specific area on your body. Now let's explore the other features of the chair. Back in the main menu, navigate down and select Sway. To change the speed of the swaying motion in the chair, select Sway from the manual menu and choose from any of the available speed options, one, two, three, and off, one being the slowest and three being fast. Now let's turn on the airbags. Back in the main menu, select Airbag. This is where you can adjust the airbag controls to get a great compression massage. After you select airbag, you can see two options. These are part and force. Select part. This will allow you to choose between five different options. Full, arm and shoulder, neck and waist, leg and foot, and buttock. Using the directional pad, choose an option and press OK. Once selected, you can change the intensity by using force. This will show six different options, one through five and off. The higher the number, the more force the airbags will apply. If you decide you want them off, simply select off and they will be turned off entirely. With the airbag set to your desired intensity, let's bring on the heat. Back in the main menu, select heat. Here you will be able to turn on the lumbar heat on or off. Now let's head back to the main menu to go over our last menu option, which is settings. Select settings. Here you will see time, language, and Bluetooth. In the time settings, you will see three choices, 10 minutes, 20 minutes, and 30 minutes. Selecting one of these will extend your massage session length. Keep this setting in mind when you create your custom massage to set the length of session desired. Next is language. This chair has two different language settings to choose from, Chinese and English. And last is Bluetooth. You can turn on the Bluetooth setting on or off. To connect your phone to the chair, this setting will need to be turned on. To pair your Android or Apple device, we will go over that next in part three of this video. Now let's pair your phone to the chair so you can play and enjoy your favorite songs, audiobooks, 
podcasts, and more through the chair's Bluetooth speakers. Make sure that Bluetooth is enabled in the settings menu on the IT8500X3 remote. Now make sure that you have Bluetooth enabled on your Bluetooth device. If Bluetooth is already on, your device will automatically detect the Bluetooth enabled massage chair around you. Select IT8500X3 in the available device section of your Bluetooth settings. Select it and ensure that the connection went through. Now you should be connected to the chair speakers and you are ready to enjoy your favorite music. Now that you understand the settings, layout, and functions of the Infinity IT8500X3 remote control, you can now fully enjoy your IT8500X3 and truly maximize your massages. Enjoy your chair and thank you for being part of the Infinity family.